of the most dynamic individuals among the many dynamic individuals that are playing music in New York today. Uh, kind of to the discredit of the music world, I think it's time that I first introduce you to Cameron Flowers, who is one of the founders of disco music and one of the innovators working hard here, hidden down behind. How you doing, Flowers? I'm all right. We, we are kind of, I want you to remain like loose and talk to New York like you're talking to your record player. And um, what is disco? <clears throat> well, let's see, what is disco? What is it to you? Uh, disco to me is uh, more or less a life for now. And uh, I feel that the field is quite overflowed with quite a bit of DJs. And uh, I don't know how long it's going to last or anything, but uh, I try to be the best at what I do. You know, and uh, it's been a, more or less of a lifetime job instead of a hobby like it is to most people. Uh, well, where is disco going? And is mahogany like a really new concept in cabaret? Uh, Mahogany, I wouldn't consider it as like a disco tech type club. It's more of a, a gala type uh, club with disco added, I would say. Disco as an exotic flavor. Yeah. Cameron Flowers, who most of us have heard of and gone seen, but this is he. The man behind disco, primarily in New York coming out of that sweet place Brooklyn and would you look at this board look at this <laughs> Music's nice when Flowers is playing here, and um, you know it's a well put together club. It's a well thought out club, and uh, you know the young ladies that come here, you know, are attractive and they mature. It's an older crowd type of crowd I like.